now i will start the web expression for how to create a simple web pages so i have exercise number 4 this is my 4 now i am changing as sample exercise sample web exercise okay yes, i am giving in this folder what are the things are available first you see i have some images i have the question paper what are the things i want to do i have one text file in the question paper i am giving the step by step how to do the instructions how to create a simple web page using this one first of all i want to go and i will select the web page the this one microsoft expression web page this is our software we just click it after we are clicking we, i want to say all the information there so first what i want to do it i'll go here create a site this is very important new site new site where is my things are available go and browse in my desktop i have exercise sample exercise 1 that is what my file here so i will go and check sample web exercise this is my thing i will open you see sample exercise if you are not giving any name this is called site name i should mention my site name here you see what is my site name create a site and name as chocolate here i will go copy this one copy then i will come back here i'll give this is control v i'll do the chocolate so where it will store my site it is stored in my web thing for example i'll give okay before i am creating you can see i'll give the okay here i give okay it is creating the web page here. so all once i created site you can see all my information question paper logo all are available embed with that particular page. now you can see this becomes what it is normal folder you can see this is a normal folder but once you create a web page the symbol you can see globe web symbol is coming so this is the meaning for i created a site site can be created only once not two three times only one site one site have many web pages clear yeah. so now i want to go and create step 2 what is the step 1 create a new web page as snickers.html and insert text from the snickers.txt this is what my information so i want to create a new html page here new html page i want to create how i will create go here file new page here general html page by default it will come html page there is lot of pages are there we want html page i will go and it is come uh, untitled one dot html i want to name it as what name it as snickers so snickers i will name it as this one so i will copy this name from the file i copy this here i will go right click right click the mouse save save it. now you can just no need to give dot html if you give this one automatically it will come will save as what html page can see clear or not once it is saved it is available can you see here available here. what it's given i insert the text from stickers dot text i will go here i'll go here here stickers dot text here is their information i will copy this one i'll copy and i will place it suppose i want this font you can see i want to make this font as heading number 1 heading number whatever my heading i want to make this is a uh, x draw small draw that is default size i want to make default size this is smaller this is larger this is um, medium that is the paragraph here you can see heading 1 heading 2 heading 3 heading 4 heading 5 like this we can make so we can apply all the headings here suppose any font i want i can use the font here this way i can use what are the other things i can do it here suppose i want to change the page property if you right click right click the most page property will come so formatting page property formatting i'll go color color i want to change background color as what this is or otherwise green lime lime color i want to give i'll give this color i can change suppose i want to change the text color so how i do this one 
So I select this fix color, background fix color completely. Whenever I type, it will come that color. So I will go here. Again page property, formatting, text color. Text color should be blue. You can give it. Whatever I type, it will come blue. Clear or not? This is for the page property I can. Suppose I want insert some images in the background. So find picture from files. So I want to insert the pictures here. So I can insert the pictures from here also. From insert pictures file from my this one. I can see some logo. I can give alternative pictures here. This way I can do. This will overwrite whatever it may overwrite. Suppose I don't want, I want to remove. What I do? Page property scope, formatting. This is this is not coming background. This is inserting image. Inserting image here. This is inserting image. Inserting image, what is the advantage? You can go and make whatever you are think. You can make it as reframe or resize. Not reframe, resize your image size. You can see here IMG is coming. This is called inserting picture. Suppose I want to make background picture. How I do? Here go. Page property. Formatting. Background picture. Click this one. Browse it. Browse it. Here I want this is my background picture. I want to remove. How I do it? Page property. Again go formatting. Remove it. I want to remove this one. This also make normal. This also makes normal. You okay? So, what are the things we learn? We learn how to create web website, how to create web page, how to create this particular font or paragraph and all. This one and font and sizes. This is what we learned in this tutorial. Now, I will save save this particular file. Save the file because whatever here I am I inserted that will be stored here logo. I'll give okay. Okay. Then I want to close the file. Close the file. That's all. Here I want. So next, how I will open here again? Suppose I want to open again. What I will do? I'll go here. Where is HTML page? This is default and Snickers is it. Suppose you can open through here. Here also you can open. Or go to web expression also you can open. So open with you can see here. Open. This way also I can open automatically all the pages and everything. So this is a way we can create a website and with pages.